I actually want to get your thoughts on something. I've just received a bit of a weird message. Oh, here we go. Weird. Julius, he's just reached out and said that he doesn't want there to be any more bad blood and he wants to clear the air with me. Will I meet him tomorrow for a coffee? Geezer should be messaging him, not you. Knowing Julius, it's going to come from a good place. Like, he's, he is, honestly, he's one of my favourite boys. Like, he's a good, good man. You know, he's a life coach now. He can, like, he's... <laughs> sorry, he's a what? God, it's just... I'm sorry. Wait, hold on, wait, wait. He's a what? No, 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 come on. Uh -huh. Come on. He's a I'm life sorry. coach. Yeah. Does he live at home with his mum? <laughs> no, what I'm saying is, he, mate, he's... He's a, he's a trainer of how to ruin lives. Is that no, what No, he's, mate... You've he's... got to have your own shit in order before you can... I don't think he's coach. got shit oh, in order. He needs to focus I've on obviously... himself before he advises other people on their mate, relationships very, and mate, their... He's very good at giving advice. It's just awkward because I know he doesn't like you and you're my boyfriend, so I feel like I'm put in an awkward position. But at the same time, the right thing to do would be for me to go, hear him out, hear what he's got to say, because I am interested. And I'd also like to make myself clear about how I feel about the situation. Then do it. You can update me of what he has to say and his really, really relevant opinions. Um, thanks for coming. No, hey, thanks for the message. Yeah, I guess, Ruby, I just want to just, like, get to the bottom of all this, really. Mm and like understand from your point of view, understand what's going on. I just want to know why the unfollowing, I want to know why you unfollowed me, friend of Miles, I want to know why I'm fake. I just want to, I just want to get to the bottom of this. Can you just tell me what's yeah. going on? I think like on reflection of everything that's happened like within the last year, the reason I unfollowed you all off Instagram is because I genuinely didn't think that any of you actually care about me as a person. Like now you're back with Rez, it's like you've discarded all three of us. In the last few months, we just haven't spoken and we haven't been great friends. And Reza and I have rekindled and you have made it really obvious that you don't like him. And it has made me feel awkward. My opinion of Rez is because of everything you said to me. Like, I've never been, it's like, no one's ever called me fake before. Like, I, just know, like, I own it. I did call you fake, so you, I stand by it. So you think it. I'm fake? Yes, I do. How? I think you meddled and got involved in something that was irrelevant. Every time I got involved was when I had your back. Yes, I didn't like Rez because of the way I thought he treated you. And after everything you said about him, and then you go back to him. I did lose a lot of respect for you, Rube. I You've lost a lot of respect for me. That, lost, that, will be, lost... that will be the reason we are not friends. That's fine. That's, but like, I'm just telling you the truth. I'm being super honest with you. This person treats you awfully and you're back with him. But, like, so, Julius, it's not your life you, but or your you, relationship. But also, but, you don't have to be but, with but, Rez. That's my no, decision. I don't. No, I don't. If you want to be my friend, you should support me rather than... You should, you should also be a you friend You just give me, me negativity. But, but, All you do is slag Rez off and you're so nasty sorry, about him. Sorry, do you him. not remember the things you said about him? I do, but then but, I've decided to go back. That's my and life and my decision. as I said earlier... You don't support it, so we won't be friends. As I said, Ruby, I'm fine with you if you're happy. It doesn't happy. sound like you are. I'm fine with you happy. It does not sound like you're fine. But it feels like your friendship with me was that she's like, when you needed me, you were friends with me. When you didn't need me and you were with Rez, you dropped me. That's I feel how. the same about you. Yes. Oh, Rez. Looking very smart. You too, mate. Julius? Rez? Can I have a quick chat with Jules? Of course you can. Cheers, boy. I'll leave you boys to it. See you in a bit. Dig Town? What's the love? Would you like some caviar? Uh, nah. I'm not that hungry, actually, mate. I, I'm good. I just, I, yeah, I just don't know if, if you heard. I'm a, I'm a life coach now. You're a life coach. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you'd be fantastic at that. Thank you. I, uh, I heard you said something differently. So, did I? Yeah. What do you think about that? What do I think about what? What Sorry, you said to Digby? Me. I can care less. I said to your face. Is it? I'm all in. I think is. you'd be a terrible life coach. Why do you think that? Because I've seen how you are with everyone else and how you are with me. That's all I need to base how it on. How am I with you? Julius, you pretty much ruined my relationship. I'm still scarred no, for what you did to me. I didn't ruin your relationship. Julius, I was a, a massive lot. problem for me. You were a meddling little to me. So that is why I'll say to Digby that I don't think you'd be that successful as a life coach. But stop talking about life coaching. Like, you haven't seen me life coach. But you haven't the seen reason. me do my job, which I help people. You don't even know Countless me. people Dude, every fucking week. Like I'm talking stop to talking about my career. Do you see that? You, you are the, such a How? I'm standing here talking to you. think you're being a Right now, no, another you're insult. literally, you actually just project all of this stuff. You, Why you're are you so getting oblivious. so wound up? You're oblivious. Why are you getting so wound up by me? Okay, I first point, here. I'm the getting wound up because you're not letting me speak. Cool, let me speak. Exactly what you've done let me to speak. me. Yeah? Sure. I'm getting wound up because you're not letting me speak. So uh, give I'm, me all the I'm all ears. Okay, good, mate. So, did you tell Ruby that you've lost all respect for her because she's going out, back out with me? Do you want to know why? No. You don't want to know why? No, I don't. I'm saying to you, you shouldn't say that to her. Right. I don't mean that awfully. I mean that it's, it's, it's actually a very common thing. Oh, I thought thing. you were f great mates with her, mate. Yeah, of course I lost respect for her. That all the things she said about you, and then she gets back with you, yeah, I lost respect. You, you, you're, a dis you're a farce. You're, you're, you disguise the fact you're a cunning, evil bloke, mate. There you go, more down. insults. Standing here calling me a farce, a all this thing. I think you are. Have I insulted I you once this evening? No, and that's where we differ. At the end of the day, oh, at the end of the day, 
See you later. You Jesus. need life coaching. F off, mate.